these videos. Uh, I'm sure they're very exciting. Um, sorry about that, but I uh, just want to make sure you understand what you're doing. So I'm going to do the income, expense, and profit page with my income. So it says to recall my income equation. So that means I'm going to go back to my the income page, right? And I'm going to get my total income equation. There it is. All right, I'm going to copy it down and I'm going to put it here. Okay, so I got that from the income page. All right, there's my income. Okay, so then here we go. YouTube makes 50 times the amount you will make from the sponsors. So whatever this is, they make 50 times that. So I'm going to write an equation. I did give you a cute little hint. It says you'll have to use the distributive property. Okay, so what that means is that YouTube makes 50 times whatever I make. Well, I make 19x plus 325. Okay, I'm going to make this bigger so you can see it. All right, so right, YouTube makes 50 times what I make. Okay. And so, but now I need to distribute, right? So I need to do 50 times all of this stuff and figure out their equation. So when I distribute, it just means to do 50 times this plus 50 times this. Okay, so 50 times 19x plus 50 times 325. Okay, so I use the distributive property, right? Think of what the word distribute means. It means to pass out equally. So I pass out 50 equally to everybody inside my parentheses. And I just have to simplify that math. So I got to do 50 times uh, 19. I'm going to quickly calculate that. And that's 950 X's. All right, I got an X because the 19 had an X, right? I'm multiplying my 19 X's 50 times, which means I'll have 50 times those X's. And I have to do 50 times 325. Yikes, Aruni, that's a big number. 16,250. Okay, and so that is going to be a YouTube's income equation. Right there. Whoa, it's too big. Okay, so just uh, equals y. All right, so there you go. There's YouTube's income equation. This is 50 times this. <clears throat> so you're basically doing 50, right? Their rate gets 50 times bigger and their y intercept gets 50 times bigger. Okay, so basically just multiply both of those things by 50. Cool. Moving on. Now it says, recall my total expense equation. So I'm going to go back to my calculations page because uh, I know it's got my totals equation on there or even my interpreter page, anywhere that you have your total expense equation. Oh, sorry, I should have had this ready. I totally forgot I needed this. So I'm going to go quickly find my calculations page or my interpreter. No, in here you don't make a totals equation that is on the interpreter. So there we go. There it is. So I find my interpreter page and I'm going to steal my totals equation straight from there. Okay. And here's my, there it goes. There it is. And then it says, this is YouTube's expenses because they are paying for your trip. So what's YouTube's expense equation? Well, the same thing. I don't really have expenses. They're all YouTube's expenses. So there is that. I don't have to do anything. It is done for you. It's already done. Okay, cool. Dookie, dookie. All right, so now it says definition. Profit is what you have left over from your income after you pay your expenses, right? So income is something that you get, kind of like an allowance or 
money you make from selling something, but you always have expenses, right? You, you know, if you have a business, you got to pay your rent, you got to pay stuff, right? And so your profit is what do you have left over after you pay your expenses? So that means I would have to take my income right and I'm subtracting all of my expenses right I have to subtract my rate right and I have to subtract my y-intercept right so they both become negative because I have to subtract both of them okay does that make sense and this is going to equal whatever his profit is. So now you see that I have, let's make this bigger, so it's easier for you to see. Doink, 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 doink. Okay, I'm gonna highlight all of my X, my variable terms in yellow. I'm gonna include everybody's signs because that is part of them. Um, all right, I'm gonna highlight all my Y intercepts in yellow, or I'm sorry, blue. <laughs> all right, so now I want an equation only has one rate and one y-intercept. So now I just have to combine these things, right? So I got to do 950x minus 438x. So I'm just going to quickly calculate that. And I get 512x is equal to 16250 minus this, right? I have my income. I subtracted my expenses. I have my income and I'm subtracting my expenses. So just rate minus rate and y-intercept minus y-intercept. And that gets me a grand total of positive $14,956.72. And so that, my friend, is YouTube's profit equation. So they can, so that goes here. And this way, the YouTube will be able to just crunch the numbers and say, well, what if you went for this many days? How much money would we make? Uh, okay, so there it is. Commas make the numbers look nicer. Cool. And so now that I have all my equations, the hard part is done. Now it's just asking you how much all of this is going to cost. Well, you have literally spent nothing. YouTube spent... Well, have YouTube's uh, expenses here, right? I already know that you are uh, requesting to go 18 days, right? So I just got to figure out how much that is for 18 days. But you should have already had that calculated on your calculations page. Oh, Lord, Lord, Lord. One of these days I will find it. All right, so you go to your calculations page. And you find your total cost for 18 days, right? Because that's what you're requesting to go. And that's going to be YouTube's total expenses. Well, what's your income? Well... You did that on your sponsor selection page, right, where you um, did your sponsors. Okay, so you're just going to find all of these things from places you've already done, right? So you might be clicking around like what I'm doing, but for 18 days I made $667, okay? Not too shabby. All right, $667, but YouTube is going to make 50 times that, right? So 667 times 50. Yeah, you can go back and use your equation, but we already know that YouTube makes 50 times that. So just, you know, do it that way, 50 times that. Profit, well, you spent nothing and you made $667. So your profit, 60 six hundred and sixty seven dollars right YouTube's profit well I gotta take my income thirty three thousand five three fifty I gotta subtract out my expenses nine thousand dollars basically and YouTube is profiting twenty eight 
$24,172.72. Not too shabby, YouTube. You could also use your equation. Substitute X in for the amount of days. You will definitely get this same answer. All right, kids. Uh, enjoy doing this. I hope this helped. Bye.